months. The burden for one Colorado veteran got a little lighter today. He'll share the journey forward with his new service dog, a chocolate lab named Lexi. Our Joel Hillen was there as he received his new companion. 100%, she knows she's cute. She is very adorable and she knows it. Tara Elbricht has been a dog trainer for 10 years. For the last six months, she has been training Dexie to be a service dog for Iraq War veteran Jason Martinez. I know that she's going to be able to really change Jason's life and make him be able to function normally in society. She completely hands it up for the camera. She's, she's just a beautiful dog. Jason served as a dog handler in the Marine Corps. The husband and father of five struggles with PTSD, depression, and anxiety. Now he'll have Dexie as a companion and help. A canine covering his six. Having someone else to, to watch my back is um, it, it's going to be huge. It's going to be absolutely perfect. There's no drugs. There's no therapy. There's, there's nothing in this world that can match a service dog in the right application. Curtis Hendel is with the Rocky Mountain Dogs Project, the nonprofit which provided Dexy for Jason. When you place that dog and you see the look in his eye and you see the veteran and know that this is going to change their lives, it's overwhelming. There's no, it can't be matched. For Jason, there is hope for a brighter future, and he's grateful for those helping to light his way. Just a thank you, uh, 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 a big and, and, and emotional thank you. In Aurora, Joel Hillen, covering Colorado First. Each dog costs about $25,000 to procure and train. If you would like to help, we have a link to Rocky Mountain Dogs Project at cbsdenver.com.